I've decided to take up biohacking, which is amateur genetic engineering, because I came across this company online, the ODIN, which I think stands for the Open Discovery Institute. And it's an American startup that aims to make biohacking easier and more affordable. So I ordered their CRISPR kit, and I'll put on the video what CRISPR stands for, but basically it's a relatively new genetic engineering technique that makes it possible to do very precise edits to DNA. The kit's taken a couple of months to arrive. Firstly, they said they were inundated with orders and had to move to bigger premises. And then it was two weeks in transit, mainly because it was stuck at UK Customs for several days, and I was a bit worried it wouldn't get through, but it did. And the basic price of the kit is $150, but by the time I'd added postage and packing, it came to £170. And then I had to pay another £20 in customs charges. But here it is, so let's open it up and see what's inside. Okay, so here's inside some uh, packaging which we don't need. Then here there seems to be some instructions. The, the kit contains enough for doing a particular sample experiment. So I presume this is what this is. These are the instructions for the sample experiment. And as well as the sample experiment, it says the kit contains enough for five experiments in total. So put those there. Then we've got some what uh, petri dishes although i've learned that they call these petri plates but with lids on some what seem to be kind of stirrers or something and what's this ah this is uh, e coli this is the bacteriological sample that is used in the experiment e coli bacteria there's a glass bottle here And what have we got? These seem to be some kind of uh, test tubes. Tube for measuring, it says. Um, this is a bacteriological transformation mix, this is. Some more Petri plates. There's that. Some uh, rubber gloves. A whole set of uh, little test tubes with uh, lids on. What appear to be some more stirrers or something, or tools for manipulating of some kind. And uh, then what have we got here? This says bacterial Cas9. I think these are these are the. Um, biochemical substances, whatever that are necessary for doing the um, DNA editing. Um, it says store in freezer at minus 20 degrees C, which um, is a bit worrying because these have been in transport, so um, they haven't been stored in a freezer. Um, I'll have to look up what that's all about. Uh, some kind of block for containing these little test tubes by the looks of it. Put all your samples in there. And another kind of block with lots of little test tubes in it. And a pipette. And that's it, that's the contents of the box. So here it is, this is all you need to do biohacking. And the next step is to read through this and understand it and have a go at the experiment. And hopefully I'll be able to talk you through that in another video.